<laughs> I know that's right. Oh Kate's got goodness. some forecast. Some storms rolled through, huh? They rolled through. Yeah. They're still rolling through portions of South Jersey, and we're going to be on storm watch kind of again tomorrow mm. because tomorrow's another hot, steamy day. Today was day three in the 90s, day three at 92 degrees, and that makes it an official heat wave. And tomorrow looks to be day four of this particular heat wave and another day with storms on the radar. Let's take a look outside up in Bethlehem right now where Music Fest this evening is starting to wind down. Still a lot of people walking around on Main Street. They've taken the cones off the street though in preparation for getting back to business as usual tomorrow. But of course, uh, Music Fest going on all week long. So a lot of people out and about and probably wondering when they'll get a break from the intense humidity in Bethlehem, in the city, and just about everywhere. Today's high climbed again to 92 degrees. Our average high for the time of year is 86. The record, 106. A little reminder that it can always be worse than 92 degrees, but it felt like close to 100 at the height of the afternoon today. What to expect for tomorrow? Well, let's take a look first at Storm Scan 3, which is showing a pretty nasty looking thunderstorm actually now over Cumberland County. So storms rolled through the Philadelphia area. We had reports of lightning and thunder, especially across the northeast. Now we're just seeing some showers over Burlington County into Atlantic County, but this storm is looking pretty intense as it moves over Cumberland County, Bridgeton, right down toward C Peterville and Vineland and Millville next in line and you can see a lot of lightning with this and intense downpour. So this is really just one spot, but if you're out and about in Cumberland County tonight, watch for that those storms and again this will move toward the shore points likely within the next hour or so. Temperatures right now 76 in Philly, 78 in Millville, it's still 81 in Atlantic City and again our heat index values in many spots it still feels well into the 80s, still feeling like 90 down the shore. So even the heat index continuing through the overnight hours, but tomorrow afternoon we expect it to feel once again like close to 100 degrees, and that means yet another heat advisory will kick into effect. The hottest part of the day here, noon until 6 p.m., and it includes all the areas you see shaded here in orange, including the city, Montgomery and Bucks counties, Chester County, Delaware County, and into portions of South Jersey as well. Our current dew point is a very steamy 73 degrees, so it feels like a steam bath when you step outside. We're kind of in between oppressive and insufferable. Not a great place to be. We'd like to be down here and refreshing. I would take not bad, though, and that's where we're going to be on Friday when we finally see a break in the humidity. So tomorrow, Dew points in the mid 70s. It's an insufferable day. Thursday feels a little better. Friday, humidity wise, at least, it's still hot, but humidity wise, it's not quite as bad. Overnight, a shower or thunderstorm, a partly cloudy 77, a very warm and muggy night. Tomorrow is steamy again, 92, feeling like 99, and there will be some late day pop up thunderstorms, some of which could be locally intense. So if you're like me and you want to get outside with the kids, maybe take them to the playground tomorrow. Probably not the best day. Very hot, very humid. Keep it indoors. But Thursday and Friday, you can get outside. And if you're getting outside to the Eagles game, looks pretty good. We're going to see a reduction in humidity by Thursday afternoon. It's still warm. It's not football weather. It's not, you know, chilly in the crock pot kind of weather, but we will take it. 80s with some sunshine on Thursday. Friday, we're back to 90, but the humidity again is not insufferable. Then we're still in the 80s over the weekend, but more scattered showers and storms Saturday. Another chance to the west Sunday. And as of now, Monday is looking pretty wet as well. Mm -hmm. So it's just been the kind of summer where we're dodging, dodging down yes, we every day. <laughs> Thanks, Kate.